He sends us more strength as our labors increase. To added afflictions, He offers more mercy. To multiply trials, He multiplies peace. When we have exhausted our store of endurance, when our strength has failed and the day is half done, when we've reached the end of our earthly resources, our Father's forgiving is only begun. Our Father's forgiving is only begun. Good morning. Good morning, everyone. Welcome, welcome to Worship Wednesday. I hope that this Wednesday finds you well. I cannot believe we're in May already. I know. I still feel like we're in March, but we're not. We're in May. So welcome. Thank you for all of your birthday wishes for Jesse. We had an amazing party, didn't we? We did. We did. <laughs> it was probably one of the best ones we've ever thrown. Jesse played the piano and uh, he had some friends sing and he had granddad on the trumpet, which mm -hmm. was amazing. And you on drums oh, and indeed. Uncle Luke on um, bass guitar. So it was a family affair and uh, it was a lot of fun and a lot of young people jumping up and singing around the house. So. We are just about recovering and uh, we're looking forward to spending this next half an hour with you just to enjoy God, to stir our hearts again in Him, to remember that He is enthroned and is Lord. So we're going to start uh, by just sharing some of Psalm 99 where it says this, The Lord reigns. Let the peoples tremble. He sits enthroned upon the cherubim. Let the earth quake. The Lord is great in Zion. He is exalted over all the peoples. Let them praise your great and awesome name. Holy is he. The king in his might loves justice. You have established equity. You have executed justice and righteousness in Jacob. Exalt the Lord our God. Worship at his footstool. Holy is he. Exalt the Lord our God. Worship at his footstool. Holy is he.
down the key. Sue, you're back. The words are up. Thank you so much. We appreciate you so much for putting the words up on the screen for us. We're going to take it from the top, maybe slightly in another key. I might bring a harmony in too. <laughs> awake, awake.
much that you reign this morning. We want to thank you that we stand in our victory. We want to thank you that you are Lord of all. We want to thank you that we declare holy is he this morning. We want to thank you that we can clothe ourselves again in your righteousness, in your armor, knowing that we are filled with your power, knowing that we can know your love drawing close to us. We want to thank you that you reign this morning. It's exciting to sing that song. I could have gone round and round and round. Come, Lord.
this week we've got uh, lots of friends who are walking some really difficult things and um, you know if the Lord isn't risen then you know this these difficult things some of the things that they're having to lay down before God and are really costly before him their offering of worship that's costly before him you know and if the Lord isn't risen then it's all in vain but the Lord has risen and Jesus is the name above every name and um, and as I watch my friends totally different circumstances all surrendering their lives to Jesus all giving everything that they have to him we want to sing again and remember that he is the name above every name what he has done what he has done at the cross what he did through his life and his death and his resurrection changes everything it changes everything about how we live and about how um how we kind of surrender our lives every day to him Jesus the name above every name and it might be that today you're carrying things that mean that that you're bringing them before God and you're making him number one you're making him number one above everything or maybe you need him to remind you of the fact that he is worthy of it all that he is worth it all this morning Jesus the name above every name Lord I just I thank you for all that you have done for us. I thank you that you have broken the power of cancelled sin, that through your death we are forgiven. I want to thank you for the generations that declare your goodness. I want to thank you that you are our redeemer and our saviour, that you are our king and our hope. And we want to lay our lives before you again and declare that you are the name above every name. And we love you and we love you and we love you. And we surrender ourselves again to you today, the name above every name.
Yes, the work is yours. There is nothing to be gained. I want something that will send when your holy fire comes. Something that will last. And to hear you say, well done, giving glory to Lord, we offer our lives again to you today. We put you first and we put our trust and our hope in you. We thank you that you're our comfort, that you're our peace, that you're our strength, that you're our hope, that you're our deliverer, that you're our healer, that you're our song today. And we come before you, we bring all our cares, we bring all our situations, we bring our whole selves before you. And may they be an offering before you, trusting that you again are Lord today. Well, thank you so much for joining us on this Worship Wednesday. It's been so good to uh, just spend this half an hour with you. And I pray that you'll have a great week ahead. Uh, we'll be back next Wednesday. I don't think there's anything else to tell you, is there? We're, at, we're in Colchester on the 7th. Um, and that's going to be good fun. Good. And so you can check out, um, I need to put it up on my website. Check out my website. Also, I'm actually uh, we're actually uh, doing some worship for the Salvation Army Women's Conference in June, so we'll get that up online for you to get the details for that too. So you can check in there. So we will see you soon next Wednesday. Bye, Bye for now. now. <laughs>